So we would like to switch between cameras using switch node. You can do it by using a if statement and this is how it would look like. So it changes uh, on the after frame 60, it changes a second camera, in this case in the input one, because after a frame 120, uh, 122, it will change to a different camera. As you can see here. So first of all, camera will be changed after a frame 60. To the first input, by default it will be input 0, this, this one, and uh, if the frame is greater than 60, the input will be changed to 1. The next condition, if the frame is greater than 125, as you can see here, and the last condition, if the frame is greater than 155, it will be changed back to the 0 input. As you can see here and i also want to point out that uh, the order of the if statements is very important here so the last if statement the frame 100 uh, 155 should be the first in this case because it will be evaluated last uh, if it changes to 60 for example e statement won't be checked actually whatsoever it will be skipped uh, because uh, this condition is already met after frame 60 as you can see here, uh, the camera doesn't change. It don't change uh, whatsoever. But if I change it back to 155, it's back to as before. Uh, so play around with the if statement to better understand it. The main point is the last condition you want to check should be placed in the if statement first. So it's kind of a, re a reverse. The first condition on the timeline should be the last, and the last condition on the timeline should be first in the if statement. Thank you.